Hello and welcome to the Between the Beats video series. My name is Elsa Nilsson and I'm really glad you're here. What we're going to do here is go through gradually in video form the exercises from my book Between the Beats. I want to start today, this very first video, so excited! I want to start with playing you something. I'm going to play you one of my favorite songs right now, Like Someone in Love, using the Big Beats metronome concept. The point of this exercise is not perfection. You may have noticed that there were some spots where I was right on and some where I wasn't. And part of what this is all about is knowing if you're a little ahead, if you're a little behind, and doing that on purpose. Because that is actually a really, really effective way to communicate emotional content in music. I like to use this big beats exercise like a meditation because what I'm really doing is expanding the space and exploring the space. The less frequently the metronome ticks, the more space there is, and the more I have to be really mindful and really fill that space in a way that is consistent and that communicates something. Over the next month at the Between the Beats Patreon page, the link is right here, we're going to systematically go through all of the exercises that I practiced in order to be able to do this. This is not a style specific thing. I'm playing jazz because I play jazz, but the skills and the presence that you develop working on these exercises is crucial no matter what music you play. And especially for melodic instruments, this is really, really important because if we can do this, it's much more fun for other people to play with us and for us to play with other people. I'm really glad that you're here. I'm so excited to start this journey with you. Please head on over to the Patreon. Let's get started. <laughs> 